Welcome back to the Bet MGM studio and Titans All Access. Titans at 25, presented by Bud Light. The day had it all. Big Blue in Nashville, a Manning taking center stage, and a Titans performance worthy of the dark, dreary afternoon that it was. And then out of nowhere, a fleeting comet who shined brightly for just a brief moment. Everyone can name their favorite Titans game. A list of your favorite top five or top ten Titans games isn't hard to complete either. But what about the great games that you have forgotten? That is a much tougher list. As we celebrate the 25th anniversary of the Tennessee Titans, we share one of the great games in Titans history that you may have forgotten. From November 26, 2006, the Titans beat the Giants with one of the most remarkable fourth quarters in franchise history. And they needed it because after three quarters, the Titans trailed Eli Manning in Big Blue 21 to nothing. Tennessee had shown no pulse whatsoever through the first 45 minutes. What the hell is going on? Because it was really a pretty decent football team talent wise. But what, what are we what, what are we doing? You know, what, what is going on down there? I mean, you know, Jacobs, the big back, was, was running all over us. We, we, we were sputtering. The Giants were greedy to begin the final quarter, choosing not to try a field goal on fourth and three at the Tennessee 31-yard line. When Manning's pass fell incomplete, the dam began to break. Young in the shotgun. Young looking, throwing in the end zone. It's caught! Touchdown! Tight! Bo Skate! In traffic, Young rolling right, penalty marker down, Young is in for a touchdown, tight. The Giants appeared to have the Titans stopped as defensive end Matthias Kiwanuka grabbed Vince Young for an apparent sack on fourth and 10 at Tennessee's own 24 yard line with less than three minutes left. Young stands in, has time, pump, in trouble, gets away, rolls to his right, Buys time, pumps again, puts a move on 25 oh, 30, 35 40, and he has run out of bounds. When Matthias Kiwanuka had Vince Young wrapped up, spun him around like they were in a dance contest, and I think was worried about roughing the passer. And that's why his arms came off of him. And then from that moment on, I mean, it, it was like there was a, a, a switch that had flipped. Young takes the snap. Looks in the pocket, throws in the end zone. Brandon Jones catches it. Touchdown! Tight! A 49 yarder for the lead with 11 seconds to go. Baronis on the left hand. Snap, set, kick on the way. Good! Six ticks. Pac-Man Jones' two fourth quarter interceptions combined with his 23-yard punt return served as his best performance as a Titan. It was the bitter with the sweet as the mercurial Jones would cost himself a chance to stay with the team just a few months later. Everything else aside was a special physical talent as a corner and as a punt returner and both of those things came out in that ball game and that that victory and and the night got colder and colder and then it was like hell yeah let's go it was really fun your favorite titans game one of the top five or top 10 titans games ever maybe not but there have been few fourth quarters at nissan stadium that have been this much fun